Hey there, Lickin' Riffers, and welcome back to yet another awesome finger style lesson here on Lickin' Riff, in which I want to teach you a 7-8 odd time tapping lick, okay, in A minor. Um, sounds complicated, but the lick is actually pretty simple. It's pretty simple because you're, uh, you don't have to move around too much. It's just a really nice lick to practice your tapping with, and it goes like this. And if you count it, okay, it's da 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 Dum 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 da 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 dum. Hey. Hey. You hammer on the A minor chord first, and then you have options. You have options. It's not a fixed lick. It's up to your creativity. I'm tapping two notes simultaneously, okay? It can be five and five on strings one and three, okay? Or it can be five and five on strings two and four. It also can be seven and seven on strings one and three. And if I want the Dorian sound, I can tap seven and seven on strings two and four, okay? So basically, you tap it and pull it off. So it's, okay? And that's basically the whole lick because you repeat this pattern. Okay? So this is the beginning, okay? A minor, you tap a couplet, okay, of your choice. You pull it off, you hammer on the A minor again, and then you tap and pull off again. Okay, you can change the notes. Okay, that's basically the whole lick, and you can you can go crazy with it. Okay, I'm going to show you in a second. But hey, okay, get used to this first. Okay, to changing. Okay, between seven, five, and five. Okay, and if you want the Dorian sound, you can use 7 and 7 on strings 2 and 4 as well. Let me play it slowly. Okay, it works better up to speed, but... You start with hammering on the A minor, and you end with hammering on the A minor. And because it's 7-8 time, it's actually a very convenient tapping lick. Now before we go really crazy here, let's go over the rhythm pattern again. Okay? I want you to feel it. Bum da 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 dum, da 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 di da dum, bum da 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 dum, ba da da di da, and then you start again. Okay, that last bum, the last A minor is actually back to the beginning. So it's dum da 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 di da dum, da 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 di da, and then you're back to A minor. But it's a lot easier to remember if you add that last note. Bum da 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 dum da 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 di da dum da 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 dum da 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 di da dum. Okay, again. Dum da 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 dum da 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 di da dum da 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 dum da 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 di da dum. Once you can feel it, you can play it. Now, 
you can tap those notes separately as well. And if you really want to, you can add eight on strings one and three and add that blue note. Okay? And you can slide between seven and eight. But then it changes your pattern. Okay? So once you're used to the rhythm pattern, you can start changing the tapping pattern. Okay? Something like this. You see? Now, again, before I show you what I did, you have to have the rhythm pattern inside you, okay? You have to feel that 7-8 rhythm pattern, otherwise you're gonna get confused. It has to be all the time. Because now it's just gonna be improvisation. So, you can start with, you can start with tapping. Okay, you can tap, slide, pull off, and then hammer on A minor. Okay. So, whatever you choose to add changes your pattern. Okay, this was the reverse pattern. I hammered on, pulled off, then it hammered on the A minor, and I did it twice. You see? But it's still the pattern. If I slide between 7 and 8, it changes again. See? So this is actually a lot easier than it sounds and looks, but really you have to internalize the pattern. You have to you have to get used to the 7-8 time. That's the key here. Okay? So before you go, check out my Break Your Boundaries course program, lickandref.com slash courses. My full course program that is designed to take your playing to the stratosphere no matter what level you're currently in. So check it out, lickandref.com slash courses. I actually just released a new course, okay? I told you about it at the beginning of the month. Um, and I release new courses regularly and every member of the Break Your Boundaries course program actually gets every new course for free. So join the Break Your Boundaries course program and I will see you on the other side. Thank you so much for watching. Bye, have fun.